All right, guys, this is the last lock from Nick's collection. This is a Corbin uh, cabinet lock or sliding door lock. Uh, it looks to be the biggest challenge here, of course, is this pinning. It's only a four pinner, it looks like. Uh, we got some really deep cuts there to get under. Uh, look, it's because it's only four pins. Usually, locks of this age, they don't use any security pins. Usually, they're standard pins. Uh, you can see how it works. The shackle goes in here when we slide the door. And then, I hope you can see in there, there are the locking bars. So, uh, if and when we get it picked, I'll turn that, and hopefully, those bars will retract either left or right. I'm not sure on this look. Since I'm turning it clockwise, I'll probably going to retract off to the right side. But we'll have to see. All right, let's clamp it up. Let's see what we got here. One of the nice things about this Hanna vise is I can put pretty much any size lock in here up to, I think it fits like eight inches. So it's, this will be plenty of room. All right, there we go. I'm going to use top of the keyway. If it'll fit in there, i use a nice thick one. And if you look at the keyway, let me get it up here so you can take a little bit closer look. You'll notice I'm going to have to be picking from this corner. I can't go from the bottom because of the warding. I'm going to have to work from the left side and kind of go up at an angle to get inside of there. And to do that, let me get this in place and I'll grab a pick. I'm going to be using, or at least starting with, a standard hook. Okay, let's see what we got here. All the way in, light tension, and let's just see if we can make this thing talk to us. Alright, I got one binder. It's pin three. Got a click out of him. <laughs> and that was too easy, right? I'm definitely not going to be gutting this. There are no security pins in it, but uh, Nick, there you go. Pretty easy to pick. Easy to get in that cabinet, but uh, as I said, we're going to turn this. If you'll watch these locking bars, they should move out of the way. And there they go. So that's how it works. All right, fellas, thanks for your time. Stay safe, stay legal. Nick, thanks for sending me part of your lock collection. I really appreciate it. And I will be getting it back into the mail to you tomorrow.